Welcome to another vlog. Good morning. <laughs> yes, it's nearly 11 a.m. <laughs> it's my, it's not my first vacation day, but it's um, the first Monday I'm on vacation and I decided to wake up around 8 and stay in bed for another three hours to watch some YouTube. I have vacation! And now I decided to brush my teeth and start into the day. It's not half a day. Um, yeah, but I will start now into the day. I have some things on my to-do list. I wanted to write one, but I think I have it in my head. So I want to do the laundry today. I already cleaned the toilet. What else? I want to write all the Christmas cards I made. I need to check for whom I need to um, get Christmas presents. And of course, there are two people having birthday at the very, very beginning of the year. And um, yeah, I need to uh, think about gifts for them as well. What else? Ah, I want to cut the last vlog and upload it so you have that tomorrow. Not this one. <laughs> and what else? I think that's it. I will inform you if there's more. And I won't leave the house today because the next days are already a bit busy with meeting friends, catching up some with some people I haven't seen in a while and yeah I'm looking forward to that but staying in the house is also comfy. I like to be at home. I thought we can open all the advent calendars, advent calendars, advent calendars uh, together. To get, um, today is the 11th so let's start with the snack calendar and here is number 11 I mean this is a real snack calendar not those tiny bags Two hands for that. Ta da! So, lentil chips, sweet chili. Hopefully, they are not too spicy, but I will keep them here <laughs> where I have everything else. Let's move on to the After Aid advent calendar. So, let's see. We are looking for an 11. <gasps> there it is. It's super easy. <laughs> it's not super easy with one hand. And there is a little bag. There's always a little bag inside and it feels like like a, like this one. Or like this? No, no, it feels like a leaf. It feels like a leaf. Maybe it's a white leaf. Could be also a white leaf. So I will put this in here. The Toblerone one is for my husband. I got a little Dobby from him. Hello Dobby. <laughs> He's super cute. Next one is this here. Let's read what it has for us today. There is number 11. How many dogs you find in the picture? Huh, okay. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
H. H. Ah, nine. It says ten. <laughs> so there are ten. Okay. Yeah, this is also quite nice. Then we are moving into to uh, to this um, advent calendar. So this is no, it's a seventeen. Ah, here it is in eighty eleven. So let's pop this into here. Ah, oh, cool. Yummy. It's a Giotto. Great. This can also be living here until we are craving for it. And now the last one in here. I guess it's not my opening day, but I, I think it's okay when I open it. So we have the 11 here. So we are having here a raspberry vinegar. Oh great! So we got already a vinegar, this one, a rosé, and now a raspberry one. Great! So the whole calendar uh, has a content of jars or bottles. I'm expecting a lot of bottles in here. <laughs> you know what's happening now? We are sorting the laundry. So I have the first machine here and I just wanted to show you my little clip bag, so my laundry clip bag. So yeah, my, uh, my laundry clips uh, inside, you know them, and <laughs> I store them in a coach bag. <laughs> now my husband, I think he bought once a coach portemonnaie or something like this and it was wrapped in this bag and I said, oh cool, can I have this bag? Because uh, the one, I think the old one for the clips um, was broken or damaged or something. And now we have some bougie, uh, bougie clip bag. I think it's funny. So yeah, next up, hanging the laundry. wondering what these are. These are little sock hangers and in, in, a, in an apple shade and yeah I've got them from this is a, from Chibo so this is <laughs> a German company and they always have things so you look around at their site they have every week new things you never knew that you need and then you discover this but these are really a game changer so they are made of silicone let me show you uh, this one because this sock is too too thin so they are made out of silicone they have two holes where you can pull through your <coughs> dirty socks you throw them into the um, into the laundry bin and they always keep together because you can wash them so they they stay together in the washing machine on the dry rack and when everything is um, dried I will remove them and put them together in the sock drawer so they are no there's no sorting of socks um, yeah, when you have dry, clean laundry, and I love it, I love that, because we are, sometimes we are having the same socks, <laughs> and I can't see when they are, yeah, when they are like this, if it's his or mine, sometimes they all look the same, 
they are all black, all blue, and so it's super easy for everybody. And the good thing is you can also hang them on the on here. You know, you can see that. Good morning. Today is super exciting because <laughs> I'm going to the hairdresser. And um, I'm going to the hairdresser, not for cutting my hair, not for dyeing my hair, but to get more hair. <laughs> so I'm getting extensions to have more hair. So this is everything I have. I'm, I just washed it and it's really fluffy when I'm wash, I, when I washed it, but yeah, I mean... That's all from the one side, and that's all from the other side. There's nothing left behind. That's it, you know. And this is a very hair-caring method. So no heat, no glue. Um, they will put some rings on some strands of my hair and then they will sew on the fake hair below the top and then there is more hair. <laughs> I'm so much looking forward to it. It's um, So I have artificial light at the moment so it looks a bit yellow but yeah. I'm super excited, really. Um, I will try to film a bit. Uh, I will ask her if it's okay. And yeah, then I have more hair. <laughs> I can do braids. You know, when I braid this hair, it's like a teeny tiny braid. I can show you. Also with fluffing, some people are fluffing the braid out, but I mean, that's it. And then you can do it like this, but it's not the same when you have more hair. And also a bun. So that's it. It's okay. I could have lived with it, but I will try. I will try. Yeah, so much looking forward to it. So we will see us in the um, at the hairdresser. Here we are. Let's go.
back again at the hairdresser because I decided for a spontaneous aqua facial and yeah, I had a good time relaxing on this warm chair. There's a heating inside and yeah, it was super relaxing. I'm happy now. I'm returning home and then I can show you the whole hair dream. <laughs> Hello! So it's the next day. I'm wearing the same as yesterday. Uh, it's Saturday. And yeah, my hair. Here is my hair. Um, I put some footage. Um, the hairdresser filmed my hair as well. So we went for blonde and for a brunette. So we mixed two colors and yeah, it feels not good. <laughs> I think I'm a bit, I don't know, it doesn't feel nice. So it's from here and here and then it goes down like this. I think she she filmed a bit beneath it and oh, it's hurting. So yesterday was hurting really, really, really bad. And today I can feel it all the time. And it feels like I have something that's tearing me down. I don't know if this will be better. I thought I couldn't feel it. I mean, it looks it looks really nice, but I'm not sure if it was worth the money. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it looks really nice, but I don't have this feeling of, woo, I have super cute hair and so on. And yeah, I hope this, this tension on the head is going away. Let's see. Um, I will wait until Monday, I think, and if I can still feel it, I will call her and ask her what, what we can do. Yeah. But yeah, so just to have an impression of the uh, thickness. So this is all the hair I have. And when I'm now doing a braid, I will do it very tight. You can see that there is more hair. Look at this. This is a thick one. And then, then I can loosen it and then it's, it's huge. But is this worth <laughs> the feeling on my head. Mm, I'm not sure, but it looks super nice. So it feels also very nice in the length, but as it is, yeah, attached to the head, it's not like having, yeah, I don't know. I can't explain it. Everybody, ha yeah, I think I needed to try it, but I don't think I will wear it um, or I will do it again. So this is my update. Um, I also went for a facial and I don't know if you can see it but here on the forehead there are some marks. So she used kind of a vacuum thing and cleaned everything and so on and it was nice but nothing that I would do again. Also, um, yeah, so that's my hair update. There is nothing planned for the weekend, so I will end this vlog here. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching, and then we will see us very soon. Stay safe and take care. Bye.